welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for tuning in for today's video if you're an old subscriber thank you so much for coming back and if you are new to my channel or you are just knowing about my existence thank you as well for clicking on this video so in today's video i'll be showing you guys how to turn your braiding hair into body wave yes you heard it right how to turn your any kind of braiding hair at all into body wave weave so if that sounds like something you're interested in then definitely keep on watching So the first thing to do is to do your closure because this is the most uh, tedious part of this wig so we want to start from the hardest <laughs> which is making a closure because it takes a lot of time as you can see i'm taking uh, like three strands of hair or maybe i was taking at most five strands of hair while doing this um closure so yeah it is the most tedious part of this Hair. so the first thing i did was to do this closure and then we'll move to the next part so yeah this is just a close-up um look of how i was doing this uh closure i had to switch from the other latch hook i wasn't um it was not um as firm it was too flexible for me and it was taking a lot of time for me to get through with the other latch hook so i had to change it to this one this one is sturdy as you can see um the hook itself the latch itself is not that long so it is short i found this really easy to use so that was why i switched to this one So frontal is done. I was done with this frontal. I did the frontal um in six hours. I didn't do it at a go. I was watching a movie. Of course, I was distracted by the movie, and of course, I have a baby that I have to attend uh, to. So yeah, I used six hours in total to finish the um closure. And the next step is to do the weave, which is what I'm doing. I have a full video of how to do your own whip i will link it up in the card so if you want a full tutorial of how to do your own weave you can go there and watch it so i was just trimming any flyaways you know with braiding hair it tends to have a lot of flyaways so i was just trimming it to make it look neat and after that i dipped it in hot water and i didn't put any products in my hot water and of course i didn't dip it in boiling water hot water not boiling water so after that i'm just blow drying it because i don't have a lot of time i want to get this done so that i can upload this video so i'm just showing you the weft the weft um before sealing you can still move the weft as you can see you can still move the hair yeah so after sealing this is how i seal my weft just use your flat iron um to melt the hair with the um um thread yes and then it will be unmovable you won't be able to move it anymore that is how i seal my weft and after that i went ahead to sew in my closure after sewing my closure I sewed the hair. Yeah, so I'll come back to tell you guys the next step. This time, girl, I know what's bothering me. I need somebody to love. Oh, na, 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 na. Don't you see what's wrong with me? I need somebody to love. Oh, oh, na, na. God, I'm sick of this waiting.
Did you ever stop and think why spend too much time just getting ready? So this is what we've all been waiting for. This is how to get that um, wavy look for your synthetic hair. I thought my camera was recording, but no, it stopped. I don't know why it stopped. So I did the rest of the wig already. I'm just showing you this part. So you just twist the hair a little bit and then wrap it around to form a bantu knot. That's just basically how I did the rest of the hair. I'll take one of it down to show you how I did it. So yeah, make sure it is well detangled detangle your hair properly make sure it is neat like no any hair flying or anything of sort and then just wrap it like that try to twist it a little bit not too tightly because it will still get tight when uh, you try to make the bantu knot so twist it like that like that and then start uh, wrapping it around like that to form a bantu knot you see what i'm doing now you see how it's getting tighter so don't make it tight at first don't don't twist it too tightly because when you are turning it like this it will become tighter so yeah that is it guys it's a shame that my hands are shaking all of the time when you're... so i had seven bantu knots in case you are wondering and after that i'll wrap the hair with a foil paper you can also wrap your bantu knots individually but that's a lot of work for me i just did the whole um wig at once oh, oh, no, no. God, so after that you can use your blow dryer you can set it on the highest like the hottest uh setting but this is what i'll be uh, using my hair steamer i use this to my hair on wash days so i'll use my hair steamer and i'll set it on the highest uh what we are trying to achieve is just to incorporate um heat into the hair to make it hot so after like i think one hour i took it off and yeah that's it guys i'll just start unraveling the hair and as you can see the curls are very nice and bouncy not too tight just uh, the wavy look that I'm going for. Did you ever stop and think why spend too much time just getting ready? Let me be honest. I don't know a single thing that I haven't done to make you notice me. Let me be real here. When I see you, my heart starts racing, but I don't know. I like this chasing and playing and waiting around It's a shame that my hands start shaking all of the time when you're around me But this time, this time Girl, I know what's bothering me I need somebody to love Oh, nah, 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 nah Don't you see what's wrong with me?
guys that is the finished look i hope you all enjoyed this video as i did filming this hair tutorial if you did please give it a big thumbs up comment down below and also share with family friends and your loved ones also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more amazing content thank you all so much for watching and i'll see you all in my next one bye love you Did you ever stop and think why spend too much time just getting ready? Let me be honest. I don't know a single thing that I haven't done to make you notice me. Let me be real here. When I see you, my heart starts racing, but I don't know if I like this chasing and playing and waiting around. It's a shame that my hands